Using state-of-the-art Templin wormhole technology, Xenonian is now able to broadcast transmissions from our sister stations in alternate dimensions. Right now, we go live to a news broadcast in the Antares system. This is Xenonian News. To the newly sufficient Antares colors. Officials from the Galactic Community's Interstellar Assembly have asked the Skrek to keep the continuous screaming coming from their embassy to a minimum. The embassy, which serves as a diplomatic hub for the xenophobic fallen empire and the multitude of vassals it's enslaved, has received multiple noise complaints from neighboring consulates. Public documents show that of the hundreds of complaints submitted, the majority referenced, quote, perpetual diplomat shrieking, that one woman who keeps screaming for help, and the weird squelching noise during bludgeoning hours. Christopher von Gebser, Foreign Affairs Minister for Antares, spoke to CBA News about the issue. I wouldn't mind the sounds of drilling intermixed with screaming if it was restricted to work hours, but it's constant at the moment. It's echoing into my accommodation and really affecting my sleep pattern. Ugh, and don't get me started on the number of times I've slipped on the blood oozing from under their embassy door. We were able to speak to Skrek representative Dreadlore earlier today. Here's what they had to say. The vast majority of sounds coming from our embassy are absolutely nothing to worry about. We are a friendly and inclusive employer that works hard to ensure all of our vassal diplomats comply with the standards expected of a Skrek convoy. UTP government officials corroborated this while holding a memorial service for the 12 envoys who tragically died this week in completely unrelated workplace incidents. Emily Turner, the latest UTP envoy appointed to the post, told CBA News that she loved working for the Skrek. The Interstellar Assembly states it has already taken steps to address the matter, including providing free ear protection to all neighboring diplomats and ensuring blood spillages have appropriate warning signage in place. We're taking a break now, but when we come back, the Great Khan announces a comeback tour performing across the galaxy, starting with Antares. Now on CBA News, to a broadcast in the United Terror Protectors. Zarissa. I'm a part-time model and the most popular girl in school. I'm also planning the biggest sweet 16 this cluster has ever seen. Daddy, I want the biggest protectorate for my birthday. But Daddy, I want a pink titan. Sweetheart, the only protectorate available is on Earth. Bad news, the humans are rebelling. You've ruined my birthday and my life. Gonna spread my wings. It's my chance to shine. Discovering so much more life. sixteen. I'm Zarissa from Zotsdale Skrek Prime. This is my super plush mansion house. And this is my family. I literally hate all of them, except for daddy, because he pays for things. Lots of Xenos are so jealous because my dad owns three planets. So we have a lot of energy credits. And that's why I'm throwing the biggest, most exclusive Sweet 16 Skrek Prime has ever seen. Zarissa, should we invite those Necroid Goth kids to the party? My theme is pink! You've totally ruined my birthday and my life. <laughs> 